Well, welcome back. Students in Wilcox County are being prepared for the workforce through a program called Work-Based Learning. 41 NBC's Elizabeth Gutierrez spoke with one student in that program about how it's helping him plan ahead. Juniors and seniors at Wilcox County High School are going from the classroom right into a job. It's all thanks to the work-based learning program that allows students to go to school while learning skills to prepare them for a career. It's a nationwide program and one of the things they encourage us to do is to try to promote our program by promoting our students. So the school will recognize one student each week. Jackson Chastain was recently recognized for his work at 10 Mile Creek grading and land clearing. Chastain has been in the program for two years. Construction nowadays, everybody needs help, sadly. But whenever I got in there, it just kind of stuck. I just, I was good at it. I had potential and I was willing to learn. And so I stuck with the company. And really and truly, they stuck with me, providing opportunities for me to learn, and it's just been a good job for me. Chastain says he grew up surrounded by family who work in the construction industry. So when the opportunity to work for his grandfather's company presented itself, he took it. You got some folks who will just, they'll do what they're supposed to do and not do anything after that. Most of the time, what I try and do is go above and beyond that by... I'll do the job and then I'll actively look for something else to do. Teachers at the high school tell me Chastain has always been a hard worker. He is a, a great spokesperson for our program. And he's also a very intelligent A-plus student. and He's one of our outstanding kids here at school. Wayne Bloodworth is the owner of the company and Chastain's grandfather. He says Chastain has always loved construction from a young age. In the vehicle when he was younger, he was grandson until we got to the job. At the job site, he was an employee. He did what the other employees did to learn the ropes. Chastain says he plans to attend college to study civil engineering and further his career in the company. In Wilcox County, Lisbeth Gutierrez, 41 NBC News. Well, the high school currently has 45 students in the program. Each week, they'll showcase a different student's work in the community.